basically does a new type of sound recognition that can detect anything from babies crying to glass being broken to smoke alarms going off so consumers can get alerts about events they care about in their homes. You can use this in environments where radio frequencies are not allowed. We have a non-invasive treatment that costs a fraction of the current treatments and could save the NHS an awful lot of money in excess of a billion a year. And we have an artificial pancreas, a beautifully simple device that uh, works with a polymeric gel to deliver insulin according to the amount of sugar in the bloodstream. As you're explaining what, what's wrong with you in the doctor's surgery, we, we've already got ECGs, we've already got blood oxygen levels, we've already got blood pressure and all that has come up on his screen so when he's found out that you're not feeling too good and you've got, he says, well you're running a bit of a fever and you're, you've got a very high heart rate and whatever the diagnosis is. is a big buzzword amongst automotive manufacturers and uh, everybody wants to have an autonomous car by a certain time frame but you know what's magnificent for people with disabilities is that you know being able to drive again is a huge level of independence I mean I just you know I turn my head to the left and it goes to the left and same with the right and you know the gas the brake it's all uh, very natural very normal and it was fun to go fast again It's great to celebrate success. I think everyone's a winner who's got here. Awards like this, they put us on the map. Engineering is probably the best, best industry that you can get into. Give it a good opportunity and give it a go.